it is me and my tea. And I am getting some major throwback vibes because today, as you can probably tell by the title, this wonderful day of Vlogmas, I have a lush kitchen unboxing. Oh my gosh. If you are familiar with my channel, if you want to scroll back to the very first video I ever recorded, it was opening a package from the Lush UK kitchen back when they had a menu and you could order from it and it would be different. I think it was every week or every month it was different things on the menu. But now I am doing a Lush kitchen unboxing again and this time it's from here from the US and I am so, so excited because this is the December Lush Kitchen, which means Christmas goodies. Oh my. So first up, let's take a look at our little box. I mean, even the tape wrapping it has festive little snowflakes. Lush Kitchen. We have a cute little pool right there because right here we have the flagship store 29 High Street. And it took me forever to slowly peel up this tape so that we can see it without ripping its lovely little design. There it is. It is so cute and I can smell this through the box and the UPS guy was like, this smells really good. He could smell it all day in his truck. So here we go. You get to be first to see it. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Christmas time is here. Okay, how's it look? Does it look good? It says a little holiday magic. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, so the first thing I see right here on top huh, is a little pin and it's 29 High Street. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I love it so, so much it is the best thing ever. Oh, okay. And then also we have, I think this is our spoiler card. It says, welcome to 29 High Street. And I think it opens up. Does it open up? I don't know. I kind of don't want to open it up yet. Okay. It might be the spoiler card. Is it the spoiler card? I think it might be the spoiler card. I'm going to set it down for now and I will look at it later. Let's see. Next, I think this is just, yeah, if there's a naked product, it tells you the ingredients. So let's slide our beautiful smelling biodegradable snow. Yes, they are back. They're going to be everywhere. Okay, let's see what we have. Ooh, 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 ooh. There looks like a lot of stuff and some stuff I don't remember voting for. Now, if you're unfamiliar with the new Lush Kitchen program, every month there is different um, items that you can vote for. You could vote for nothing if you're not feeling it, or you could vote for everything, or maybe one or two things. And I believe at the end of it, everybody, I think once all the votes are tallied, we have our items. So first up, ooh. We have a cute little box, and again, it's 29 High Street with pool on the outside of the box. So let's see what this is, because I can't think of anything that we voted for that had, oh my gosh, that had this on it. I don't remember this being one of the items to vote for. I think this was an exclusive. It is a 29 High Street scented candle. Okay, so I have always, always, always wanted to smell 29 High Street because it is a exclusive scent to the Lush flagship store and apparently it is supposed to smell like you're walking into Lush and it's basically the smell of a Lush shop on the back. It says exclusive kitchen candle step into where it all began and recall the ambience of the Lush's original shop. <sighs> okay. Okay. I'm, I'm going to peel it back. Smell it. How do they do that? Oh my gosh. It does smell like you are. I don't know why I'm holding this up to you. Like you can smell it, but this is the smell of a Lush shop. 
oh, this is so cool. And like, if I ever need a Lush fix, I can just go and sniff this. Holy cow. Okay, so first one, happily unexpected, happily received. I'm going to set it right here next to my vintage Rudy right there. That was the first Christmas thing I ever bought and I've never opened him. <laughs> All right, more lovely things for the kitten to play with. Ooh, up next. Ooh, it looks like the perfume got through. So this was one of the items you could vote for. So it is perfume. I don't remember which scent it was though, but I'm pretty sure I didn't vote for it. <gasps> oh, okay. So it is 29 High Street Perfume. And again, it smells like a lush shop. <laughs> this is so bizarre, but so awesome to finally have every scent from Lush be in one thing. Okay, so we have two 29 High Street items. Awesome, awesome. And that glorious pin. Next, we have a full size shower gel and it is Happy Holidays. And it is so beautiful on the inside. Look at it just glitter and shimmer. And oh my gosh, look at it, it is gorgeous. And it says a delectable cherry chocolate scented lather. <gasps> Ooh, I cannot wait to see what that smells like. But first we have to peel off the sticker right here and see the secret word. If you ever get um, lush items that are in like bottles or tubs, if you look behind the little sticker with the person who made it on it, there should be a secret little word. And there it is. And it says season's greetings. And our wonderful person that made our shower gel. So thank you, Susan, for making this. And literally the instructions for how to use is get naked, hop in the shower and lather up. No joke. That is exactly what it says right there. Okay. So let's open this up. I can't wait to smell this. Ooh. Ooh, it smells like, oh, this is divine. It smells like a cherry cordial, like one of those Queen Anne cherry cordial things. Oh, that smells great. Chocolatey, cherry-y, fantastic-y, glittery. Okay, up next, doo -doo -doo -doo, we have a bath bomb, which again, I don't remember that being in the things to vote for but it's very, very cute. It looks kind of like, like a little elf. I thought for voting it was the man in the moon bubble bar, but I guess this guy is here too. Ooh, and that is a very interesting scent. I do not know what this is. So luckily we have our little cheat sheet right here. And it says there's no room on the nice list. Okay, so this is called There's No Room on the Nice List. I have no idea what year this was from. And let's see, it is Rose Oil Popping Candy Violet Leaf. Ooh, yeah, that's, I definitely smell that. Sandalwood Maple Syrup. Interesting. I don't exactly get the maple syrup, but I get the rose and violet leaf, and that is really, really nice. And then next, we have a winter bath oil but it is ginormous and I've actually had this before and if I can find the video I'll put it right there and I'm so glad that it got voted through because it is just so stinking pretty this is the winter nights bath oil although I could have sworn that the old one was blue and white but yes so this is the bath oil and you could like hang it on the tree, which actually I've saved mine and have done that for the past couple of years and they're still looking really good. Or you hold this over the tap while you're taking a bath and it makes it really luxurious. Bath oils. I love the bath oils. I wish they would come back more. And let's see the scent of this fragrance, Marumaru butter, uh, neroli oil. 
it doesn't exactly give what the scents are, but it's a very soft, calming, almost maybe a little bit um, ominy. Ominy, is that word? So yeah, that is very nice. And I'm going to carefully put it back so that I don't touch it and make it melt everywhere because these things do melt quite a bit. I'll just set it right here on top. And I think that is, yes, that is everything. We got five items, wait, ten, five items. We got the bath oil, we got the perfume, the shower gel, the candle, which was an awesome surprise, and the super cute pin. And I'm going to open up the little card. I don't want to ruin it though. Ah, okay, come on, open up. Wait, maybe I could like stick my, will it open for me? Come on. I am not good with perforated edges. Uh, there we go. Yay! There it is. For days when the world is too much there it with, with da, da, da. for days when the world is too much with us there is lush. <laughs> that is so cute. And is that is that all of it? Does it open up any farther? Nope. Well, that is just super cute and I'll set it right there. So, yeah, that is it my first box. It's Christmas. I am happy. It's interesting though that I could have sworn the man in the moon bubble bar was one of the options and we got this little guy, but he's pretty darn cute. Cute little elf. Well, everybody, I hope you have enjoyed this lush unboxing. It's really taken me back to my roots for YouTube. It's crazy. I'm opening a Lush kitchen box again, and it's made me so, so happy. I smell like an actual Lush shop, and who could ask for anything more except... Thank you so much for watching, everybody. If you are interested in checking out another video, you can go ahead and click right here. And if you're new, welcome to my channel and go ahead and click that subscribe button so that you never miss my videos ever again. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in my next Vlogmas. Bye! You just saw I wouldn't do it. It's tradition. <laughs> Happy Vlogmas!